Well, I just got done changing all of my info. So, I'm doing this video for you. All of, all of Sony's systems allegedly hacked by new ransomware group. They claim to have hacked, let's see here, uh, 6,000 files. So, we could be one of them. You could be one of them. There's a new gang on the dark web that claims it breached all of Sony's systems in a ransomware attack. According to a September 25th article from Australian cybersecurity publication, Cyber Security Connect, the PlayStation maker was cracked open by, and, uh, by Ransomed.vc, a new outfit of hackers that's only been operating six, since September through the publication, though the publication suggests the gang has connections to previous dark web forums and groups. Cybersecurity Connect reports that the hack allegedly unearthed screenshots of Sony's internal login page and internal PowerPoint presentation outlining test bench details, several Java files, and a document tree of entire leak housing 6,000 files. We have successfully compromised all of Sony's systems, Ransomed.vc proclaimed, we won't ransom them. We will sell the data due to Sony not wanting to pay. Data is for sale. We are selling it. Within those 6,000 files of supposedly a bevy, are supposedly a bevy of documentation, including unknown build log files, a swath of Java resources, and HTML data. Many of the files are reportedly in Japanese. While Ransom.vc hasn't listed a price for the data, the group left contact details for Sony to get in touch and listed a post date of September 28th, which might be when Ransom.vc will just post it all. Interestingly, Ransom.vc seems to be a ransomware operator and a ransomware as a service organization. That means that alongside these large-scale hacks of major corporation, Ransom.vc which VGC claims operates out of Russia and Ukraine, also reportedly works with the EU's General Data Protection and Regulation, GDPR, and other data privacy laws to report vulnerabilities in company systems and violations in laws. According to Cybersecurity Connect, the group is leveraging laws to reportedly bully victims into submission. Sony told IGN on September 26th that it was looking into the claims we are currently investigating the situation. We have no further comments at this time. A statement issued to the public uh, publication read. Oh, boy. So, yeah. How many times has Sony been hacked? This is like the third time. Ah, good Lord, man. Change your passwords and all your info, okay? Okay, so you're not one of the people whose files are sold online, all right? Good Lord. I tell you, this cyber age is really cool, but stuff like this uh, really messes it up. Post comments down below. Let me know what you all think about the situation. Uh, if you enjoyed my thoughts on the situation and my uh, advice, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. Whoa.